Hi guys, Chris from JNS again. Um, we've got a brand new uh, waterproof winter glove here to show you from Frank Thomas, our own brand. Um, it's called the Frank Thomas Aqua LT glove. Um, lovely glove actually, it's a really nice design, nice to look at, um, but there's a few special features on it, so I'm going to show you all about them now. Um, it's 100% waterproof, of course. It has a, a waterproof liner inside the outer, um, inside underneath the outer material of the glove. So it makes it 100% waterproof. So the outside may appear to get wet, but it won't leak through to your hand. Um, that's the, an aqua pore liner that's inside there. So it's actually porous as well, so it allows your hand to breathe rather than it just being a plastic bag that makes your hand sweat. Um, opening it up to get inside, you've got a uh, Velcro wrist strap put it on there, there we go. Fairly decent length cuff and the cuff's quite wide as well so you can get the cuff of your jacket underneath it if you want to but saying that at the same time um, close that wrist strap up there so it's securely on the hand. It will also pull in nice and tight here as well so that if in really heavy weather you wanted to put your cuff of your jacket over the top to stop the water running down and running inside the glove, you can do that. That's a mistake that a few people make. They, they presume that because the cuff is on over the top and you're traveling on, along at speed, the water's just being blown up your arm. It doesn't work like that. Um, sometimes the water can run down the inside of your sleeve on your jacket and run inside the glove and start filling up underneath here. Run into the glove and of course, it's got the waterproof liner in it, so it's just like a, a glove filling up with water. So you need to avoid that. But there's another little feature on here that also helps you with that. Once you've fastened it up, they give you a little um, storm cuff, which is an extra little cuff that sits around the inside of the, uh, of the cuff of the glove there. And it fastens as well. It's got a cord that runs through it on this cord here. So you can pull that like that and it tightens that cord up, that cuff. So if you can't get your jacket cuff over the top of that, you can still keep the jacket cuff inside and pull that nice and tight and it just helps keep the water out. It may still get a little bit in, but you won't get an awful lot in. Um, and that keeps that nice and tight. You can see it's tight on the wrist now. Um, so that will help uh, keep that water out there. Fairly easily undone just by squeezing the, the speed lace toggle apart like that, loosening it off. And then you can just loosen the cuff back off again to get it open and it opens up dead easy again. A few more features on it as well. On the palm, if you're going out in inclement weather, nine times out of 10 it's wet and it's very easy. Obviously we've got rubber grips, but in some cases it's still quite slippy on the grip. So they've made a, we, we, Frank Thomas here, we've, we've put a, um, a, a grippier liner on the palm of the glove itself with some reinforcement. Uh, this here, it's, it's called a super fabric, but it's quite grippy and tacky. So when you grab the, the, the grip of your bike, it's, it's quite grippy and helps you hold on, especially if it's raining. So that's going to help. Also, there's some reinforcement here on the inside of the palm, just to make that, uh, just make it wear a little bit longer as well. You've also got some protection here, um, an Aramid material pad together with a carbon look pad. This, just to give you that bit of protection, if, you, if your hand does hit the floor, if you take a tumble, that's going to protect the, the ball of your, your palm, if you like. Um, that's the same protector that's on the uh, the racing gloves as well, the, the Raptor glove that, so um, we've, we've just transposed it across and put it on here as well, uh, together with an overlay of leather, so that's built on over the top there as well. Turning it over on the back of the hand, it's a mixture, it's a mainly a leather glove, but it's also textile, it's got some textile inserts there as well, so you've got a, you've got, you haven't got a big heavy glove because uh, obviously leather weighs a lot more than textile does so we mix it just to make that glove a little bit lighter and a little bit more flexible as well so it's comfy when you've got it on. It's a really comfy glove to start with this um, but as you wear it in obviously it will get comfier. There's protection built in here, PU protection built into the, knuck the, the finger knuckles and of course you've got a carbon fibre uh, protector on the back of the hand across the, the face of the knuckles there, a little Frank Thomas badge Another piece of protection built in, just some, some foam protection there, just built into the back of the hand. It's a lovely glove. Works really well, 100% waterproof as well, which is great. And it's nice and warm. Thermal liner inside, so it's going to keep your hand warm as well. Um, but yeah, that's brand new from Frank Thomas. And that's our um, 
Frank Thomas Aqua LT glove. 